Smile and learn. Numbers divisible by three. I want to put three oranges in each box. To find out if the number can be divided by three, there's a neat trick. We have to add up all the digits, and if the result is divisible by three, then the original number is two. Let's see what happens with all the oranges we have. There are 4,175,676 oranges to sort. That's a huge number, but that's okay. We'll do it one step at a time. Four plus one is five. Five plus seven is 12. 12 plus five is 17. 17 plus six is 23. 23 plus seven is 30. And 30 plus six is 36. Let's check if 36 is divisible by three. In this case, dividing 36 by 3, the remainder is 0. That means 36 is divisible by 3. Since 36 is the result of adding the oranges, applying the divisibility rule of 3 means that there will be none left over if we pack 3 in each box. But what happens if we add the digits of a number and we get a very huge number? Doing division with such a large number would take us a long time, and what we want to know quickly is the divisibility of a number. In that case, after adding up the digits of the original number, we would go back and add again the digits of that number which we have obtained as a result to get a smaller number. If we get a number divisible by 3, then the original number should also be divisible by 3. When we added the number of oranges, we got 36. If we add up the digits of 36, we should have a number divisible by 3. Let's test our theory by adding its digits. 9 is a very small number, and we know that if we divide it by 3, the remainder will be 0. The divisibility rule of 3 is super fun because we can add digits as many times as we need. Isn't it very useful? We've learned so much in just one video. Did you know there are many more videos? Imagine how much you could learn. Subscribe to the Smile and Learn educational channel to learn and have fun at the same time.